Hey guys, hey guys, it's State here with PPG at the Miami Regionals with uh, Travis. And what My name is Travis Smith and I play for Pro Play Games in uh, South Florida. I've been playing competitively since I believe uh, when I was in ninth or 10th grade, so I'm guessing when I was around 14, 15, I picked up my first structure deck, I guess. Uh, like, I guess Maki Nigiri was kind of like uh, the first competitive deck that I played and then you know it evolved from Black Wings to Light Swords. I was introduced to a locals by my friend Jesse who uh, he took me to locals. I, I, I won my first ever tournament. It was a sneak peek and then I understood like I knew the basics of the game. And I played against like some known people like Hector Harris that tournament. I was like I was a kid. I mean I was I knew the I knew mechanics like trade-offs like you know how to how to create a plus one and how to uh, create simple card advantage but that's all I pretty much knew how to do and then and, and card interactions and I was just playing at one locals for like two or three years near uh, near Miami Beach. So I mean, it was a, it was a couple minutes from my house. So I could I would literally just take a bus and go there. So I was I was comfortable. I didn't really care about like all these all this YCS stuff and all these you know pros and stuff. I was just like I like I, I enjoy the game. I understood on a level that I feel like other people couldn't. I'm like I mean I'm like I would say to myself like this game is so basic. You get a bunch of one liners and like nothing really too difficult. I just feel like I'm like why do people play that? The card's horrible. Or, like why, why do people do this and this and this and then I started telling myself hey let me let me put that this theory into play and so I went to like some couple case tournaments when I when I got to like when I became 17 and uh, I would like win those or go undefeated or split top eight I was just on fire like uh, when windups came out I was on fire and like I couldn't really be beaten um, like I felt like I had the perfect build and then I won a, I won my first YCS I won YCS Miami 2013 I topped ARG Orlando I believe it's uh, 2015 or 14. I topped uh, YCS Atlanta. I topped uh, every Nats since 2014. I love Yu-Gi-Oh to death and I love the friends that I accumulated, especially in South Florida. Right now, I guess I'm at the point where I'm, I know I'm on pro play games and everything. And I, I mean, I love I love the owner. Like I'm, I'm, an, I'm an actual friend with the owner and he's an amazing dude. He's funny and he's, I, I guess because of all these types people I'm with surrounded by as I'm still playing but I mean I wish I could quit you know like Yu-Gi-Oh right now is pretty cancerous I mean hopefully I can win something big and then I can probably retire I join pro play games because um, I personally know the owner and I think he's the smartest he's a base to me he's a genius there's just no competition out there like it's just why would you be sponsored by any other uh, card game uh, card store owners or whatever organization I love uh, pro play games